Update. Rejoice, rejoice, the beast is back. All right. My big baby is back. Time to build water pump change finished. Um, I got plans for this weird car. Uh, I think I'm going to do it either a gray or tan. Put a big star on it, some bigger wheels. Ah, can't wait. This thing has served its purpose for years. So rejoice to all the YouTubers, my car is back. So made the voyage to work in the um, Accord. It drove, and just to let you know, I didn't do the time of belt water pumps. I have a, I have three guys that do um, mechanic work for me because I can't be bending on my back's no good for that anymore. But um, so far so good. The uh, the next thing for this car is it needs a uh, rack and pinion, and I need to do shocks and all the front end. But this car runs. This is for the 2001 Honda Accord. Um, got to work. So I'm gonna do some more stuff to it, repaint it. Got some big wheels coming in for it, and uh, I'm gonna make the car chunkier. Uh, it's, it, 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 and like the, I love to have this thing running. I'm glad it is. But this is just a part of uh, bringing the the old two, old one Accord back. All right, guys. All right, what's going on, guys? This is Wolf from from Bosu America. I haven't driven this in a day or so, but um, I'm starting the process of taking the decals off. Um, this whole car, I'm going to probably paint a darker gray. Uh, I'm going to take the front wheels and put them on the, the back wheels on the front and I'm going to keep those as spares or I may just repaint them and put new tires on all of them. It's one thing I'm thinking about right now because at least three of these tires need to go. That one's not in bad shape but I know that needs a tire, that needs a tire, that needs a tire but after I get done with all this and strip the bumper off I got to get a new trunk, uh, racket pinion and um, just the shocks. I got all that ready but uh, I'm pulling you know decals off today I think I'm actually going to leave these on for right now. I'm going to leave those on because I like those so much. But um, what else am I going to pull off? I'm going to pull off the big Honda one up there. I'm going to pull those off today too. And then I don't think I have many more to pull off. Let me see. Let this car go by. Oh, it hasn't. Yeah, I'm going to pull this one off today too. Uh, the one on the bottom I'm not going to get to because I got to get down there. But um, I got to pull that one off too, this one here. And I'm just taking my own sweet time and just pushing at them and pushing them on. Then I got to start sanding because I'm going to sand the crap out of this and also the bumper. So I don't know if I'm going to do the same thing I did to to the Civic, which is just do the half paint because I actually like that idea. So I'm thinking about doing that one gray. It'd be kind of a new style for me. And then just uh, buff the other side out real good and sand it down. I don't know. I have to figure out what I'm going to do with that. But um, I enjoy the way the big Accords are made. Always have. Uh, that one is officially gone. Since um, my buddy did the time about water pump on that, I gave him that for doing that job. So that's finished. But this one, <sighs> this thing is always the one that's running when my cars are busted. And I'm going to leave it alone. I was going to cut it into a ute, but I haven't made that decision yet. But I'm still thinking about cutting this one into, like, the little um, truck. I'm thinking about it. All right, guys, I'm going to get back to work, finish this up, and I'll get back to you. All right, I should have my thing, but I lost it. Hey, guys, what's going on? This is Will Foreman from Bosu, America. Well, it's a decent day outside. So I got off work, which I was going to get off earlier. I had to go to another store and work, but going to the junkyard. So if you made it this far in the video of my content, which I had a lot because of the winter, I'm going to the junkyard. And uh, I'm looking for some wheels, and I'm, I keep talking garbage, like I want an H23, but now a 23 swap, I ain't going to do that, I don't, don't have the manpower or the way to transport it, but I'm going to walk the junkyard, see what they got in it, and going down to Jack's, so stick with me guys. Alright, so as you can see guys, I am back in the junkyard. I mean, winter time makes you want to fucking just kill someone, so I am out to go look for a set of wheels for my my Honda, my other car, and I'm going back here to see, which I can extremely doubt that, what are those? Huh. What car is this? What size wheels are those? Those are... 
Seventeens. Huh. Might have to come back by here and look at those. I'll take two of those. Those ain't bad looking wheels. Paint them a different color. But I think, uh, as always, when the winter comes, everything rebuilds. Look at that. Rebuilds back up and you can come down and tear some shit apart. Oh, I get so excited when I come to the junkyard. I'm curious to see if this car, no, I think that was it, wasn't it? No, that's not it. No, that's not it. I'm gonna take my old sweet time today and look around. But um, look like I might have found some wheels right off the back. Those were four lugs, but I don't know what the uh, bore is. Sometimes you can get away with those um, the hub, the hub part, but sometimes you can't. So a lot of times I just stick with the Hondas. Period, and I'll use the Honda factory wheels. Look at that CB7. Oh wow, suck! I had one of those. There's my buddy Gus's truck, but Gus got another truck. He ain't worried about it. So I'm not really looking hard, but I'm gonna go way back here because there was a car back here and I actually figured out how to get the wheels off. Uh, one thing I, you probably don't know is that the CRV top parts right there fit in the Accord seats. Yeah, that's still back here. I'm surprised no one got that. Like I really do like working, you know, just with Hondas. I mean, I like using the factories. Look at that cap. I might just pop that cap off and take it. But who knows? I'm going to go back here and see if that car is still back here. I can extremely doubt it is. Because I let it go in the wintertime. I had something else to do and I never came back to look at it. And I can almost bet those wheels are gone. I can bet $100. Now look at those. Those are in really good shape. CB7s. Ah. Yeah. Nice little Honda. Well, the car gods have looked upon me. They're still back here. All I want is two of them. That's all I want. I may work on trying to get these, but you know why I didn't I couldn't get them off? It was simply because the the bolts are so far down inside of there, I have no idea how to get those out of there. God, I wish I had the knowledge to get those. Those are still there. But it's the problem is getting them out of there. I have no idea how to get those off. I'm almost willing to pay just to get two of these off of here. But these are... See this? That's what I didn't like. That's why they're still back here. Because nobody knew how to get these fuckers out of here. Probably everybody then came and checked for the key. And just left them alone because, you know, you just can't get them out of there. It's really sad and pathetic that the person who had this car didn't just put the fucking key in the car and just say, fuck it. I mean, you sent it to the junkyard, you ass balls. And the door is locked. Damn, I tell you, man, I would love to have the least the, the two, just two of them. Crap. And they, they double lug too, man. That's the only thing that's disappointing about this kind of shit, man. You find it and you can't get it and just, you know, food for thought. All four of them are on here. God, that pisses me off. But I'm going to look in that car. That looks suspect. All right, guys, this is all I'm going to film up to now till I find a set of wheels, which I think I did all the way down to the other part down there. I may just grab those and then go from there because I like the way those looked. And they looked as simple and they looked like they had a hub bearing that a fit, but I wish I could get these. I wish somebody had the knowledge to tell me how to get those off. All right, guys, I'm going to look at this one car. It looks suspectish. Once again, this car eludes me. I wanted those wheels so bad, but I just don't have the knowledge. I need to do some research on that. But if you get rid of a car and you got wheels, just put the damn thing in there so somebody can enjoy them. Asshole. Well, I don't know the circumstances of the car, so let's walk on. All right, I'm not going to film for a minute. I'm going to walk around and see what's here.
I think I filmed this one last time. Man, bust the window out. Or maybe they did it. Here's a newer Accord. Surprisingly. Oh, I knew the subframe was gone on there. All right, so let's go take a walk. See what we can find. I'm going to walk around for a minute. If I see something of value, I will let you see it. Look at this. Look at that. Very unique. I don't know what kind those are, but... There's a name brand on them. That's why I love walking back here. And just kind of looking for stuff. Because sometimes, look at that. Good boot. <laughs> if you need a boot. Wait a minute, is that a lawn dart? That's a lawn dart. One of the most dangerous toys that was ever made when I was a kid. Sandbag, good exhaust. All right, so this is the Honda van that I want. They are just so hard to come by. I've been looking for one of these forever. Never could find them. It's not in too bad a shape. I don't think I want to mess with that. I'm curious because I can't get the trunk. Sometimes the key is in here. Let's see if the key is in here. Oh, yes it is. So, let's get the key out. Which is really nice. But look what I just found. Yeah. Let's see. Oh, no wonder. So, I forgot this year the trunk would open by the electric. There is no keyhole. Which is very surprising. Sometimes I forget about these newer cars without that. There's something in that trunk. But I'm going to take this key and put it back in there because someone may be looking for it. I may come back for two of these. These actually are 114.3 as well. Didn't know that. It's on a Nissan SE. SER. I was only got one good tire on it though. I'm going to look some more. Bolts. Wow. All right, before the movie start, uh, last thing for today. I had some Jeep seats that I traded for these wheels. So, you know, this is Will from Bolts of America. Got these bad boys free. Flipped them for a pair of seats, and I got these. I only got two. Somebody painted one, and the other one's copper color, but it doesn't matter. You can still get these wheels, but I couldn't pass the deal up. Uh, boy, go cough over there. All right, guys, I'm out. This is the end of the day of everything I got finished from Bosu America. Oh, man, what is